we have a situation with our government that's gone on for quite a while where we've um, strayed away from the intent of what the Constitution and our laws are supposed to be about. We're forgetting that our um, Constitution was written in order to line up with the Word of God. A lot of people don't want that known because, well, let's be simple about it. They're sinners. They don't want to stop sinning. Well, here's how I feel about that. You know, you want to sin, that's your business, but you don't push that on me. You don't force it on me and my kids. And you don't try to change our government's foundation because you can't handle behaving yourself. That's not my problem. And people that want to change things because they don't want to behave themselves, there's sort of like a narcissist type of mentality going on there that we need to um, look at because those are the people that need mental health care reform. You don't tell me. When I've watched people die for the Constitution, you don't tell me not to fight for the rights that the Constitution guarantees. And you darn sure don't tell me that I have to conform to your sinning either. I'm not a Bible thumper. I'm just a regular person who loves the Bible and loves God. And people are offended by that. That's not my problem. Stop attacking me because you don't want to live the way I live. I don't attack people that live the way I don't want them to live. I just don't want them shoving it down my throat. That's fair and it's real. And I don't want them teaching it to my children either. Because I'm not going to force my ideals and my, my um, beliefs up on a person who doesn't want them either. So you're supposed to show me the same respect that I show you. And if you can't do that, and it's too hot in the kitchen, get out! Have a blessed day.